My name is Stephanie Schwartz, and welcome to Our Hillel. I love being able to come here in the middle of classes and hang out. There's always an open door, someone to talk to, somebody to go to Shabbat dinner with. I think that being part of Halal really made me appreciate the tradition. But not only that, I think it really helps you experience the idea of family. It's like the only place on campus where I feel like I can really be myself. The Hillel of Broward and Palm Beach serves the undergraduate and graduate Jewish student population at five universities in South Florida. Florida Atlantic University, Lynn University, Palm Beach State College, Nova Southeastern University, and Broward College. Each year, five to 6,000 Jewish students are on these campuses, and it is Hillel's challenge to provide engaging and meaningful Jewish experiences during these identity-forming years. Hillel is not only the thousands of Jewish students that attend college, on campuses in Broward and Palm Beach. It's a community that sees the importance of helping develop these young individuals on campus so that they can become the future Jewish leaders. No other organization in this community can transform the community itself other than Hillel. I love the opportunity for students to be involved in Jewish life on campus. The publicity that goes out to the entire student population about the excellent programs, uh, many times they have very catchy names and uh, hit the students exactly where they are. I'm a big fan of the uh, Asian Shabbat dinner. However, uh, the poker night is always fun. One of my most memorable events with Hillel is when I brought my grandmother to uh, a Holocaust survivor Shabbat dinner we had. She loved how the kids were so intrigued by her story. Death by Cheesecake, which is every year, is the most amazing program because it's all-you-can-eat cheesecake for $5. There's a program called Light Up the Lawn, and it was just a fantastic experience seeing everybody come together by music. My favorite events are the ones where I can interact with the older generations, the ones who can teach us things about, about the traditions that they had. Hillel affects students in, in many ways, and each student is affected differently by Hillel. There's always a place to sit, study, talk with friends between classes, and it really is a home away from home for people that don't live in a dorm. Part of the reason about Hillel that keeps me coming back is that I'm much more involved than I ever thought I would be. And I first came to this Hillel, pretty much a small fish in a big pond, and uh, through networking and making friends has made me a big fish in that same pond. If there was no Hillel in school, I probably wouldn't have any of the friends that I do. I wouldn't have the social experience that I had in college. It opened a lot of doors for me. It really kind of either gives you time to focus or time to get away, which is really a really nice balance. I'm meeting people away from my school that are Jewish also. Um, since going to a small school, it's uh, hard to meet people, so meeting Jewish people is a lot of fun outside of school. No matter where you come from, um, if you're interested in learning about Jewish life or being committed to Jewish life, then there's a place for you in Hillel. Going on birthright, it kind of opened my eyes and made me realize that um, it's okay to say that you're Jewish and I'm proud to be Jewish. I felt like I made such a connection there, not only with like the people over there, but the, the, my friends that came with me. Every Jewish student should be going to Israel because you really find yourself and it changes you as a person. A wow moment for me when I went to Israel on the birthright trip was definitely the day that we hiked to Masada. We hiked to the top at sunrise and I got to look out on top of this uh, historical momentous mountain and look out at the Dead Sea. We went to the Western Wall at the Kotel and it was the last night of Hanukkah on Shabbat and to see hundreds of people there you know, praying, singing, and dancing. You know, that to me was really the aha moment of, I am Jewish, this is why I'm here. There are students that will go and experience life for a week or two in another state where they're helping out needy families. We have these immersive experiences that exemplify Jewish values. They're doing it with other Jewish kids hugely meaningful to these students. This past winter break, I traveled to Los Angeles where I had a very rewarding trip. We worked at the Boys and Girls Club and also a YMCA. We did a lot of community service on this trip, 
and we got to hang out with the kids that we helped. We repainted a lot of it. We built benches with planter boxes. We put up a lot of paintings and murals everywhere and we just made it nicer for the children. And we rebuilt their place in a, in a physical sense and also tried to rebuild their morale. I was inspired by these kids. It just showed me that the little things that we can do will help somebody else. As Jewish people, we have an obligation, we have a responsibility to help our families, but to help other people too. It's a Jewish belief that we should leave the world a better place than when we entered it. I definitely got to experience that firsthand. The future of the Jewish community is at stake. Hillel is the key to engaging young Jewish college students to become part of our future. To everybody that's helped donate some money to keep this place running, this Hillel, I just want to thank you from the bottom of my heart because without it, I would not have a place to come between classes. I would not have had a place to work last year. And to be honest, it really is a home away from home. These kids tend to stay in this community, so they are very, very much directly our Jewish future. Without a Hillel to gather at, Jewish life would be substantively diminished and our students would not have nearly the quality of Jewish experience and opportunity. Funding a Shabbat dinner or donating money so that a student could go on a trip to Israel, we get to see the impact. I think the legacy that we as a community can create will be a growing, thriving, responsive Jewish community for generations to come. We're not only teaching our Jewish college students but we're teaching their children and their grandchildren and hopefully their great-grandchildren. What we need to do in the community is to find some additional resources so that these really energetic staff people can go out there and build and build and build. This is really an investment, a long-term investment on young people, but it will pay off in huge, huge dividends down the road. Hillel is the Jewish future. Because without Hillel on the campus, there would not be Judaism on the campus. Helping us to continue what we're doing and helping us to be a part of something bigger than us. Be a part of Hillel, be a part of the traditions, be a part of the religion, be a part of the learning. I think it's just so important and without those people who do help us, we wouldn't be able to do that. I am Irene Saatchi and I am Hillel. My name is Jordan Schiff and I am My Hillel. My name is Carla Klein and I am Hillel. My name is Terry Samuels, and I am Hillel. I am Hillel. I am Hillel. My name is Dale Pratt, and I am Hillel. My name is Brandy Edelson, and I am Hillel. I am Hillel. I am Hillel. My name is Rabbi David Englander, and I am Hillel. My name is Eileen Wolgamuth, and I am Hillel. I am Hillel. I am Hillel. I am Hillel. My name is Scott Brockman, and I am Hillel. We are Hillel. Together, we are Hillel.